Campaigning for the most powerful local political job in Japan has officially begun. More than 20 candidates are vying to be Tokyo governor. It's the most crowded race in history. Yuriko Koike, who became the capital's first female governor four years ago, is seeking a second term. Michio Ishida has more. Crowds assemble in the heart of Tokyo. They are here for a familiar face. Former actor Taro Yamamoto blames Tokyo Governor Yuriko Koike's handling of the coronavirus outbreak for the capital's rising homeless population. Mr. Yamamoto is not a novice in politics. He leads a small political party which produced two lawmakers in the upper house. Lawyer Kenji Utsunomiya is former head of the Japan Federation of Bar Association. He's run for the Tokyo governor's seat twice before with the support of major opposition parties. Mr. Utsunomiya is campaigning on a platform of opposing Governor Koike's plan to privatize public-run hospitals. He also wants the Olympic Games to be cancelled if the virus is not contained. A relatively unknown face in this race is this 46-year-old former vice governor of Kumamoto Prefecture. He started his campaign in Shinjuku's red light district. Nightclubs here are linked to several clusters of infections. Tokyo is the most difficult to Tokyo. The race for Tokyo's gubernatorial office has always been a crowded one. This year, there are over 20 candidates vying for the post. COVID-19 is definitely the big highlight during the Tokyo gubernatorial election campaign. Candidates are going out to the streets to tell electorates what could have been done better. Well, where is incumbent governor Yuriko Koike? Well, she decided to focus her campaign online. For now, the incumbent is considered a shoe-in by many. But voters are also expected to watch closely the number of new COVID-19 cases in Tokyo during the campaign period, which lasts 16 days. Since Ms. Koike's decision to ease movement restrictions in the capital, the number of new cases has seen an uptick in recent days. If the situation worsens, it could sway her chances of re-election. Michio Ishida, CNA, Tokyo.